Welcome to this episode of Fort Worth Forward. We're here at the market at Ridgely and we've got a great panel together today to talk to you and tell you about what's happening here in Fort Worth. We've got Amanda Ware, who is the owner of the market at Ridgely, Erica Ramos and Katrina Johnson with Steer Fort Worth, and Reggie Robinson with Funky Town Food Project. Let's get this started. Hey everyone, I am thrilled to be here at the market at Ridgely with Amanda Ware, the owner. Amanda, welcome. Thank you. Thanks for having us here today. This is uh, a crazy amazing place. Oh, well thank you. And my ADD loves coming in here <laughs> because there's so many things, so many vendors. It's true. Tell everybody what this is and how you got this idea to bring this together. Absolutely. So the market at Ridgely is a cooperative retail space. We have approximately 70 different local vendors um, inside the store and they can rent spaces ranging from a couple of shelves to large, almost boutique size spaces. So, and, and so give some ideas of some of the things that are here. We really have a mixture of everything. Yeah. I tried to make it a one-stop shop when I was selecting vendors. So we have women's clothing, men's clothing, children's, plants. Yeah. Um, we even have grab-and-go foods. Okay. And a, really a mixture of, of just everything you could possibly want in one space. And now I'm here with Erica Ramos and Katrina Johnson with Steer Fort Worth. Welcome, guys. Thanks for how having are us. Yeah. Good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. good. I'm very proud of all the work that y'all are doing, and I've got obviously a special place in my heart for Steer Fort Worth, um, having served in capacities there, executive committee, and now seeing it continue to thrive under y'all's leadership. You're president now, right? Yes, that's correct. And you're president elect. Yep, I will be starting next year. Yep. For, <laughs> so for our viewers that don't know about Steer Fort Worth, what is it? What What was the purpose, et cetera? Why? Why? What, what does it do? Yeah, so Steer Fort Worth is a nonpartisan, nonprofit organization that seeks to grow our emerging leaders and get them civically engaged in Fort Worth. We actually started back in 2011 under Mayor Price as a result of low voter turnout in that demographic. I think there's and like five, four or five percent of voters, 20 to 40, voted in that election. Yes. Yeah. And, uh, and so Steer Fort Worth was created. And in 2016, we officially became our own nonprofit and have continued the work since then. That's uh, wonderful. You you brought up too that about being a, a chef. Now you're an educator, but a chef. I want to give you a little chance to talk about your own sort of entrepreneurial, oh, wow, you know, yeah. what you're doing now with with uh, as a chef, Little Boy Blue. Yeah. So with Little Boy Blue Barbecue, man, we uh, we serve love and we love serving. Mm -hmm. It's a uh, it's a uh, just sort of a, a passion project based on our, our grandfather, little brother, and I run it, and uh, we get a chance to to do what we love to do, which is to serve food. Again, we, we are grounded in this work mm -hmm. that food sustains us all. And so let's make sure that we're adding love to it. You know, yeah. that's yeah. it. Well, I, I was honored enough to go to one of your dinners recently, which was wonderful, sort of collaboration. Yeah. T talk about that a little bit, the oh, collaboration man. that you did. So the, the work that's going on on Magnolia um, with just the boom of their economics. There's a, a restaurant there, the pantry. Yep. And oh, they're, they're doing. Natasha, a friend yeah, of mine. Yes, yeah, yeah. They're yeah. doing really cool stuff, and uh, they invited me out. They invited Scotty Scott out, who's got the cookbook out, and uh -huh. you got to get that cookbook. Yeah. It's crazy. What's it? You remember what, what's it called? I forget. Uh, fix me a plate. Fix me a plate. Fix me a plate. And I think it's based on some of his grandmother's mm -hmm. recipes, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And so we we just got a chance to get in the kitchen, and again, it was this explosion of people who are really good at what they do and then me. Yeah. And so I was <laughs> <laughs> excited to- You're good at to, what you do too. It was great, <laughs> it, was it was wonderful. Yeah, excited to get to hang out with them and, and just serve and, and looking forward to many more co collaborations. That's wonderful. Well, where can people find you? Funky Town Food Project and Little Boy Blue Barbecue. Talk about both of those. Yeah, so uh, funkytownfoodproject.org, okay. right? Plenty of information on there. And then there are gonna be those who listen to this and wanna get involved. Uh, we've got a donate page, we've got volunteer opportunities, lots and lots of ways to get involved. We're looking for board members. Um, as far as uh, our social media presence, you can find us on Facebook, we're on Instagram as well under the same uh, Funky Town Food Project. And then with the Lil Boy Blue Barbecue, again, Facebook and Instagram, uh, Lil Boy Blue, L-I-L. Okay. B-O-Y Blue. <laughs> BBQ and uh, come come look us up. We we cater. We do private dining, private brunches, all kinds of stuff. Well, Reggie, I appreciate what you're doing and putting a focus on 
um, areas that we need to continue to do in Fort Worth. We're a big city, we're a growing city. Yeah. We've got disparities in, in lots of different ways. And I appreciate what you're doing to sort of highlight that and make sure that we're addressing it where we can. So thanks yeah. for being here today. My distinct pleasure. And thank you for the work that you're doing on the council. Uh, I thanks. love the way that Fort Worth is moving right now. I appreciate it, appreciate it. We're trying. Yes, we sir. Got a, we got a great city, we got to keep it that way and keep it moving forward. So I appreciate you saying that. No doubt. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Love it. Love it. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Fort Worth Forward. As Amanda, the owner of the market at Ridgely mentioned, Dolly Parton on the side of her building. You can't miss it. Come check out the market at Ridgely. Check out our other guests here at Fort Worth and the Funky Town Food Project. But for now, I'm working nine to five and I got to go do a business deal with Jolene. So we'll see you on the next episode.